People do seem to willingly give you their phones and and get them into all sorts of trouble. A lot of people are up for it. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's been amazing. In fact, I was just... Uh, and, but, of course, you don't realise, because we're filming it, you know, every week, a lot of people are getting texts, and I've just run into Gok Wan in oh. the corridor, and he says he gets a text every week. He seems well, to be in every <laughs> single person's <laughs> He's work. so showbiz. <laughs> yeah. You've got Jamie Oliver coming up, haven't you? You do a sense Jamie Oliver is in uh, one of the shows in Show 5. Yes, yeah. he, he, it might be my favourite one. It's quite hilarious, that one. Yeah, you seem to get a real buzz out of reading out the messages that are embarrassing your celebs up on their yeah. balcony. Yeah. Well... Who buzz. wouldn't? Yeah. Well, because there's something about doing that that it's kind of always funny. Mm. Even if it's just someone going, who are you? Yeah. I don't know why the audience <laughs> still laugh. It's just such a fun dynamic to see what comes back. And there's been some hilarious ones. And sometimes it's funny just because, you know, there are big stars and stuff and sometimes... I mean, on this weekend we've got um, Alexander Armstrong doing it and he has... Uh, quite a fun exchange with his upholsterer. Oh, does um, mm -hmm. Which he finds him very, very embarrassing. And, uh, well, the text is, um, if I can get it, give it away, it's quite a fun one. Tease us, yes. I basically text everyone in his phone that they have bad breath. That's the essence of it. Oh. And uh, there's a lot of hilarious oh, replies. Oh, gosh, I That's can imagine. Some quite confused people. Hugh Bonneville gets back. Oh, it's, oh, it's really? very fun. Yeah. Upholsterer and Hugh Bonneville. <laughs> Only he yeah. would have those yeah. numbers. Um, it's not just about the, the big stars. The though, upholsterer it? actually said in her text back, is that why you haven't picked up your chair for over a year? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> that's brilliant. Um, the, my my favourite Saturday show that's just gone, uh, the end of the the, star, the star of the show, yes. the unexpected star the of the show. Unexpected star went very. He was amazing. He was yeah. amazing. So all the the windows come down and he's on the stage in Drury yeah. Lane. Completely. He was completely in shock as well. I mean, he was completely. It's it's amazing to see how people react week on week, because they're completely. Well, I mean, you can imagine what that's like. The walls literally come down around you, and over the series there are some extraordinary hits. <laughs> you know, we had people applying from the first series because we did it in the first series. Yeah. And uh, so we had a lot of people to choose from, so we were able to pick some extraordinary talents, some amazing personalities, and we secretly filmed him singing. I think it was that song I had him. It was like another ruse as a sort of a secret audition. And it just completely blew me away. Yeah, sort of it's goosebump great. times. Yeah. And I was so excited to hear him on the night. And also it's so surprising because you don't imagine you know, it's was always crying. surprising. You His never wife know. Was crying. Everybody yeah. was crying. Yeah. But the, the, yeah. obviously the, the show is edited down. I was wondering from that moment where they're completely surprised to composing themselves to then sing in front of the audience, yeah. what happens in between? Well, we... There must be some sick buckets nearby, people just yeah. wondering what the devil is going on. Well, in the first series, we went from their arrival to the performance, and then I realised in this series that we needed to see exactly that. So we filmed them now. As soon as they come off stage, we're, we're filming the whole of their preparation, and there was a little VT before they come out in every show to show you, because it's fascinating, because yeah. they genuinely have, um, you know, whatever, less than an hour to get, them, to get that mindset <laughs> <laughs> on and perform. It's an extraordinary what they have to go through. And this Saturday, um, we're doing it with a 12-year-old girl. So oh, it's gosh, gonna be, wow. And, and she's amazing. And she had to... Yeah, I surprised her earlier that day. Um, you were dressed up, weren't you? I, you were... I was dressed up as a fortune teller. Yeah. Yeah. The Unexpected Stars that night are... Um, we have 21 NHS nurses who come down oh, from Scotland wow. thinking they're there for an audition and get into a lift, which is a fake lift, on the stage, and the doors open on the other side and we surprised 21 people. Oh, and well, we'll have to wait for that. Wonderful. But in the Great meantime, characters. it's on this Saturday at 8.10 on BBC One. Thank you, Michael. 8.10 on Saturday. Night. See you there. Thank you, right, Michael. If you enjoyed that, there's more of the same right here. And make sure you subscribe so that you never miss the best moments from this morning.